birthday. And you know what today is? It's a great day today. Mm -hmm. The city of Austin getting ready for Rodeo Austin. Yes, it all gets going today with the annual Cowboy Breakfast. Let's mosey on over to Dave Riggs, Tina Shively. She is live at the Long Center where all the fun gets started. We're going to stay in about half an hour for everybody, but you're already having a ball, aren't you? I am already having a ball, and I'm trying to plot out my, my route, what I'm going to try and what I'm going to eat this morning, because there's lots of great things when the gates open at 6 o'clock, but I've heard one of the best are the biscuits, and I've got the man in charge right here. This is Brian Frankham with the Wishbone Wagon. Good morning, Brian. Good morning. How are you doing? Very well, thank you, and I'm very intrigued by what's going on here. Explain to us what this is. Okay, this is Dutch oven cup cooking. This is uh, the way they did it on the trail. Uh, our ancestors did it. Uh, you put some coals on the bottom of the ovens and coals on top of the ovens. And anything you can cook in a regular oven at home, you can cook out here. How many biscuits are we talking about in this pan okay, here? There's about 50 in these, each one of these pots, and we've got six pots going. So we're just hitting about 300 a lick, and we can do about four pots an hour. So we're making about 1,200 biscuits an hour. And we've got the ladies, Sabrina and Susan, actually making those 1,200 yes, biscuits. They have to make them before we can cook them. <laughs> and, and, our, and our job is to cook them and not burn them. Right, right, right. Very, very, very gently make sure that uh, things don't go over too fast, right? Right. <laughs> uh, these are award winning biscuits, I've heard. Uh, yeah, matter of fact, in 2012, we won Cheyenne. Uh, so we're pretty proud of that. But yes, uh, Pioneer has a very good product. It's very easy to use, it's user friendly, and uh, you know, there's great biscuits. Right. So, Brian, tell me, why do you keep this tradition going? Well, you know, you need to know where you've, you've been before you know where you're going. And so, uh, we just want the kids to understand, you know, that especially Texas kids, we do a lot of school tours with kids and, and things like that. We tell them, you know, other states were carved or born, but Texas grew from hide and horn. And the, tra the trail drive tradition is what really kind of got started, uh, Texas started as a, as a state. So. so when I talk about the cowboy breakfast to people back at the station, they tell me this is the thing to have. So it's just you and me here, no one else watching, Brian. Tell me, uh, what's your secret? Time. Time, okay. I thought I wasn't going to get an answer there. <laughs> got a little nervous that we were uh, tapping into the, uh, the secrets of the biscuit making. So lots of great things. Well, I told you the secret, it wouldn't be a secret anymore. Very true. Wise words, wise words. So lots of great things out here. We've got breakfast tacos, of course. We've got all kinds of things to eat. Uh, cowboy coffee, I've heard, is another amazing thing that you need to try. So uh, some entertainment as well. We've got people warming up on the stage. So uh, the best part of all of this is that not only is it delicious, Brian, but it's also free. So I expect, Brian and Yvonne, you guys are going to come down here when the show's over, right? Hey, that would be mm. fun. Tina, I was a little worried for you when there was dead silence. <laughs> I was thinking, what's going to happen here? I know. <laughs> I thought maybe I broke some kind of taboo by asking for the secret here. But, uh, <laughs> but Brian is uh, giving, us, giving us a little bit, but not too much. Uh, behind the scenes. <laughs> okay. Great. Thank you so much. Brian and Yvonne, back uh, to you. That's, uh, you know, Tina, that's something you need to learn. You never ask a cowboy how he makes his biscuits. No. I mean, that's something you've got to learn. I guess, I don't know. <laughs> he just made it up. Yeah, like he, that. well, he wasn't going to give it away. And you know what? They're worth, and it's free, and it's at the Long Center. So don't forget, fun. it's not at Auditorium Shores where it was last year. It's right over at the Long Center this year. So just across the road there. But man, it's fun.